hey y'all it's your girl minimum and in today's video i'm going to be showing y'all how i stretch my hair out without using any heat so let's jump right into this video okay okay so after i stretched my hair out i was able to accomplish this slick bun um y'all but i will tell y'all it was not easy so i have a video coming out soon on how i accomplished this slick bun but y'all go watch all my f ups y'all already know okay moving on okay y'all moving right along i'm just gonna go ahead and part my hair into four sections your parts do not have to be straight or anything just make sure you get your hair in four sections four sections okay but anywho y'all yes i am in my bed so i like to be comfortable when i'm doing my hair so if y'all was expecting me to be in this little pretty background with flowers or something like that y'all just not gonna get that okay y'all just not gonna get that i am going to bed after this because your girl is tired like tired okay so let's put our hair in four sessions and we're going to move on to the next step okay y'all moving right along moving right along so the next step is what y'all what am i getting ready to use what am i getting ready to use y'all should already know i'm getting ready to use my avocado moisturizing milk y'all already know this stuff is bomb so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna take that and put it all through my hair okay so we just gonna keep putting that through our hair because we want our hair to be what y'all very moisturized we don't want no dryness over here so then after that i'm just going to take my detangling brush but of of course y'all i drop it but it don't matter because i'm going to change the detangling brush anyway because this one is just not working out right so anywho once you get your detangling brush go ahead and make sure your hair is detangled really really good and then then we're going to put our hair into a ponytail and then we're going to go ahead and braid it and we're going to do the rest of the sections just like that Okay, y'all, so I'm going to ramble a little bit while I do my hair. So for those who don't know, well, well, y'all don't know because I never said anything. But anywho, I started the No Heat Challenge back in January of this year. And I'm pretty late, but I'm not really late because it's never too late to start anything. But basically, the No Heat Challenge is going a whole year without putting any heat in your hair. So that's what I'm getting ready to do. I mean, if y'all want to do this process with me, that is fine. But if not, you can just follow along and see if I can accomplish my goals. But anywho, y'all, look at your girl. Like, I got some hang time, y'all. Your girl got a little hang time here. You know, I'm excited. I ain't stretched my hair out in so long. So I didn't even know that my hair was actually the length that it is now. So I'm glad to see that, you know. Your girl ain't bald head. She ain't bald head over here, okay? I don't want to offend nobody. If you're bald head, that's fine, too, because we're going to get you to grow. We're going to get your hair to grow. Okay, so now I'm going to take my oil, and I'm going to rub it on my braids and also my scalp. And, okay, y'all, look, I got to ramble just a little bit more. But as y'all can see, I use rubber bands to put my hair in a ponytail. I already know. I already know. Rubber bands are bad for your hair. And I know we trying to grow our hair, our hair over here, so we don't want to use rubber bands. But sis, I did not have an elastic hair bow. So I got to use what I have until I get what I need, period. Okay, so moving right along. Okay, so y'all, once I get done rubbing the oil in my hair, we is on to the final step. But really quick, I am not big on oil, so I'm... I use anything that I have at the house, but some people think that oils actually play a part in growing your hair. So if you think like a, a, a Pacific oil plays a part in growing hair, please let me know because right now, y'all, I just use any oil I have. I think they all kind of do this, does the same thing, but I can be wrong. So that's why I need y'all to help assist out and leave a comment letting me know if oils grow your hair. Okay, so anywho... The final step, y'all, the final step is to wrap my hair using my silk scarf. But, of course, y'all, I cannot find my scarf. That's what I'm over there doing, um, trying to find my scarf. But really quick, I did want to come on here and show y'all that I had less hair. Well, y'all already know I be messing up and doing these voiceovers. Uh, but I'm not erasing that, y'all. I'm here to show y'all where I mess up at. So, y'all know voiceovers are hard, are hard for me. So, anywho, final step, I'm going to go ahead and put this scarf on my head. I know, y'all, it's not silk. I know in order to grow my hair, I need a silk scarf. But what, what do I say, y'all? We're going to use what we have until we get what we need, period. All right. So, I will see y'all in the morning. 
Good morning, beautiful people. So today is the day where I show y'all my hair is all stretched out. Yes, finally. Okay, so we just gonna take these rubber bands out of our hair. Be careful when removing the rubber band. We do not want any breakage. Y'all know the goal is to be growing our hair, not pulling it out. Okay. Okay, so this part is really simple. After we take the rubber bands out, we're just gonna take our um, comb, our the biggest comb we have. What is it called? A wide tooth comb. Uh, y'all know, y'all know where I'm getting at with this. We're gonna take the wide tooth comb and we're just gonna comb our hair out, not rough. Um, you know, do it, do it gentle, but you know, we're just gonna make sure it's just stretched out really good, y'all. But um this is very like easy this is the easy part so i'm just going to ramble a little bit while um the video is playing i know y'all tired of me rambling i know i keep on saying i'm not going to ramble 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 but i almost forgot to tell y'all the most important thing like the most important thing that i wanted to share in this video was the length of my hair let's do a test of how long my hair is so that come next year we can see if the things that I've been doing actually help grow my hair. So, um, I don't plan on putting any heat in my hair. Y'all already know that. And I'm not going to stretch it out and see the length of my hair until next year. So, with that, I'm going to show y'all how long my hair is in the front. And I'm also going to be showing y'all how long my hair is in the back. Again, if you want to um do this no heat challenge with me feel free but if not you can just watch my journey and see if i can accomplish my goals and that is it for me y'all okay y'all so i've been talking long enough so i'm getting ready to end this video but really fast if you have any advice um about how i can grow my hair please leave a comment down below remember y'all i am new to this so i need your help i need your help um any advice would be greatly appreciated. But y'all, let me go ahead and end this video because here is the finish. This is it, y'all. I stretched my hair out without using any heat. Look at that. Like, yeah. So now the journey begins. Okay, I'm just going to let y'all look at this. I'm just going to let this sit right here a little bit. Y'all know I stretched that out good. Okay. So, anywho, I know I've been rambling, y'all. So, I'm just going to go ahead and end this video. Goodbye.